see his chest. Right. That's right. what I'm trying to do. Oh, it, isn't see. that the money maker anyway? Yeah. Is that what that was? Exactly. Selling, driving views? Hey, y'all. I'm about to about? see what's going on with L.A. I feel like I'm about to be attacked. That's very quiet. That was very quiet like and silent. Like, hey. Like, she's she's like, hey. She's like, hey. I'm about to. They crack these knuckles. Right. <laughs> right. It'll be easy to find. Let's see. Is it spicy? Yeah. It's just a little tart. Yeah, it's just. Yeah. 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 Chipper, yeah. and then you know, hey, 
the <laughs> third time is always the charm. Because I is that charm, baby. Oh, he is that Indeed, charm. I'm that charm. You is me. I is me. You is me. You is me. <laughs> is right. me is me. Right. Yeah. So how old are we? For, huh? Well, will we be on the hmm? 17th? Fourteenth? Uh, ah, yeah, yeah. That's the one. Right. Fourteenth, we will be thirty-ish. Thirty-ish. Yeah. Right. right. That's good. Yeah. That's good. I don't, I, don't want, I don't think the fans want to really just be when they hear how old I am. Because you know, with age comes wisdom. Yeah. But they, they don't have me. So like, there's no right. way that we got to be. Older He's than not that wise. Right. Twenty-six. You right. Know. Yeah. Perpetually. Yeah. yeah. Well, they're just like, wow, this guy here looks fantastic. Who says that? All of them. All. Every one of them. All four. All, all 400,000. 100,000? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fans. Yeah. We should be cutting your yeah. check cut. If we all about me. All about me, baby. But the money in the face, Charlie, what you think? Right, listen. Then you know what we drink. <laughs> right. Mm. From the top of the little bit of. If oh. you go to oh. no, I'm right. Uh-huh. One hundred at gmail.com. At gmail.com. At gmail.com. It is able to be purchased along with your no, I'm right. Fit it. Right. Would you also request a no, I'm right. One hundred at gmail.com. And you know what? Since it's the birthday month, and it is the month of giving, okay, and the month of living, if you mean right, I am going to graciously mm. give away. A no, I'm right T-shirt. Listen, look at this guy. You are never. You are. You, you are such a generous person. I'm just saying. And you know what? Let, 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 me, let me capitalize that one with this. With what? Tell him again. Every show in September. I'm giving one away. Each show this month. Right. I'm giving away a shirt. So that's coming out of your cut. I, uh, cut, sir. Oh, the shirt. Sure. <laughs> you know. The shirts were made for me right. as right. a gift. Right. From the finest, finest designers. So I don't remember. I remember the part where we where I paid for some of the that was, that, That's for your stuff. I mean, I'm for talking about the, okay, so the stuff. designer stuff. So that you're giving away me. your horse, your shirts. My, the designer thing that was made was for me. Right. I'm taking care of my public. Right. Right. And public. Public. This will only be available to those who call in on the show to jump in on the topic that we're discussing. Only. Yeah, when they have to call. When do we start receiving calls? Oh, we we can get calls. They just don't call. Have we ever given out the number? And yeah, we gave the number out. But you know what? When my people, we... my people get so mystified when they just see me on right. camera. They, they get like shell shocked. They, 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 they just like, oh, I don't want you to be nervous. Don't be nervous. Right, 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 right. You will dial this number. You will dial 203 802 KMWI. Which is? For, for the people who like they can do it. Um, you will. There will be five six nine four. So again, two zero three eight zero two five six nine four. Dial it now. First caller in gets on the air. Gets a no, I'm right T-shirt. This compliments of your boy. Right from the his, guy. That's from his cousin. the man. Yeah, the myth, the legend, the one, Mister L.A. Runs Down Barnard. That's what he is. Right. Ha <laughs> ha. Right. So. On to what happened now? What happened now, baby? <laughs> what happened now? You know what happened now? Well, the yeah. popping show that's going on right now yeah. that I'm hearing on all the streaming networks mm. is something called a, a Righteous Gemstones. Have you heard of that? Um, you know, you're a nerd. Yeah. You watch yeah. lots of TV. But I'm not a. You know, socially in the up and all. Oh, 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 oh. Geological. Whoa! Whoa! Wait a minute! Wait a minute. This ain't the stage at all. Let me go ahead and answer this. How we gonna do it? Do you know what button to push? Hello. What would you know I'm right, you on the air caller? Hello, this is Boy of the Queen. This is who? What the say a little loud, please. This is Boy of the Oh, well, hello there. Hello. Welcome wait. to the Know I'm Right wait, Show. Wait, one of the who? Queefs? Queefs? I thought you she said one of the queens. Hello, what? Is one that a queens? sheep? Oh. I'm calling her what she, she said. She La queens. Oh, ja, ja queens. No, that's a sink. Okay, okay. Hello, how are you? 
Laquisa. And got bars. Got bars. Okay. Yeah. Congratulations to you. You are the first recipient of the No I'm Right t-shirt. What do you have to say? You're on the air. It's all yours for about uh, 10 seconds. Go. Send us your information, the shipping information, and we will get your shirt out to you. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to get that. Uh... No, I'm right. One hundred at gmail.com. Thank you, Kyle. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there we go. So, That's it. Princess, That's... So, Princess Queen, <laughs> get the shirt. Get the shirt. She can sing. Well, well, sing is she can she put oh, yeah, she put it together. She put something together. Well, I don't know about the IQ oh, level. <laughs> right. Not disparaging about the fans on the air. She called in and was like, yeah, She? No. It was a man. So what I found out based off that phone call it's is that the majority of our fan base is usually high when they watch when they watch it. It's a man. She was, it was definitely It was a man. Sorry. She was <laughs> LaQuisha. Sir. I heard LaQuisha. What happened now, Nathan, as I was saying, the right to Gemstone show. And I uh, also want to do a recap real quick. I'm sorry, sir. What, what did you stop? They told me that that was a guy. Who was they? The audience, the audience told me that was a guy. I was totally unaware. We are going to continue with the recap. Of the chicken sandwich store. Chick fil A versus Popeyes. It's still somehow relevant. We, we have unisex shirts, though, so I guess it wouldn't matter. In the days and oh, times no, 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 no. of how quick social media turns things over, we're still going on about this now. Right. So much so that right. your brethren. My brethren? Nah, you know what? I can't say that because they pro black. They, they pro black. So. I'm no black. No black. No so black. in Houston. <laughs> There was a violent altercation concerning being sold violent. out of the chicken. It was violent enough to where arms was bared, sir. He bared arms. They bared arms. Right. And they came, and an old boy was told, yo, there ain't no chicken sandwich here. You're going to have to go elsewhere for your yummy meat, Tony. Right. He got mad. As, as such, you would. Parked the car. Oh, he went outside. Told his kiddo. Right. Hey. Hold down my six. I got this. Took his gat to the door, and then the you know employee had to come lock, lock the door real quick. He about to go over there and shoot the folks over a sandwich, over a chicken fried sandwich. I guess it'd be apropos to say that he was going to shoot them over the fact that they didn't have sandwiches. So, so the lack of sandwich caused gunplay. So I don't understand mm -hmm. why this same dude mm -hmm. didn't fight this hard when his baby mama said, you can't see Tyrell no more. What? But he was so angry on running up in Popeye's because they ain't had no cheap set. You ain't got to have no paying a child support, did you, Lorel? But you sure want to have your son more than just weekend. Also, it's Lorel and Tyrell. Right. So and so you want to call on his hand over chicken sandwich. So did he rob the cook? Did he rob them? Or did he just say no chicken? No chicken. Bullets. Bullets. Equals bullets. Equals bullets. And it was going and was gonna take up the land, gonna turn up. Did he get arrested? I don't know what happened to that man. Yeah. All I know is that we are praying for Houston. We're praying <laughs> not for everybody Houston. <laughs> just to do this but we are praying for Houston for being out of these Popeye sandwiches. Cause they is in trouble. First the floods, right. then the hurricane, right. and now the N word they give me. How about that? Houston's right. in trouble, man. Houston, Houston we have a problem. Right. <laughs> okay, we got a big problem. That was beneath you. That that one right there was. Good. Normally, I, no, I'm not with you, my G. But that one right there yeah. was beneath you. Yeah, yeah. If you say it twice, it doesn't make sense. So stop. <laughs> Don't do it again. Be a good play. Right. Walmart is ending the sale of certain ammunition at their stores. Mm -hmm. So you know all them little, you know, short barrel firearms that you holster with you and your hunting buddies. 
doing whatever they want to do. They, you know, they, uh-huh. they're they're not going to be able to go to Walmart for their hunting needs anymore, Nathan. Right. What you feel about that? Well, I would think that people who use you know ammunition who hunt, as you say, ammunitions, ammunitions, ammunitions. Oh, well, munitions would probably be better to say. Okay. Uh, can find a plug mm-hmm. for the bullets. They out from the plug, right? <coughs> whichever one, you know. Right. Still, either way. Mm-hmm. Uh, no, I mean I don't be having trouble finding Walmart. Is, there's there's Bass Pro Shop. There's Academy Sports and Outdoors. Uh, they all have that. Bullets, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Shop, they sell bullets. I think there's, there's gun shows every weekend. So you're not Walmart. outraged by Walmart not not getting your gun, not getting rolled back on your ammunition. You're not bothered by that at all. I don't shop. Them. I, I have I have a He's moral one of those. right yeah I am one of those people that does not shop at Walmart uh, for a couple of reasons I don't have to get into them right here uh, there are a couple of things that I have issue with Walmart you know more political than anything but uh, no I don't get my juices and berries and fruits and tires and batteries and, all in the same place right one stop shop one stop, one stop shop not interested right no no Wally World is not for me Sam's now Costco. You like Costco. Like Costco. What's the difference? Right. They both, Sam's and Costco both got to have membership one, cards. One, one is owned by, by Sam Walton. Oh, so you don't like Sam? Well, I don't like Walmart, you know, except for their business practices. So would this what be safe to say uh-huh. that you was a hell, bro? <laughs> yeah. It's only 15 minutes in the show and I had to hit you off with that. I'm a hater. You was a hater, bro. Absolutely. You Why ain't going to walk more for it. And it brought many of low cost items and appliances and all that to people for years and years. Right, but well, that's speaking from the end user point of view. I'm speaking from the vendor point of view. Their business practices with their vendors are a little uh, unsavory. Uh, More the only vending you do is in a machine. Right, sure. Okay, call that. You yeah, want to anyway. Away. Last thing, which you also know nothing about. Right. Zeke Elliott, Ezekiel, if you will. Ezekiel? Has oh, that Ezekiel bread. I like that stuff, man. No, it's really good. Bread. Seven grains bread. It's good no, stuff. Delicious. Spots. 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 So. Well, I'm a. I'm a Z- I know you are out. You know, okay, Spongebob. I'm a head out. Look at, look at boy. Right. So, <laughs> Zeke is his 41 day uh-huh. camp hold out. He's done with it. You know why? Oh. <sighs> because you okay. just said, all right, Zeke. Okay. How's 50 million sound? Outstanding. So the contract extension mm-hmm. was a guaranteed fifty, mm-hmm. but he can make up to ninety by extending six more years, making his total eight years left with them boys a hundred and thirteen million dollars. So it's fifty million guaranteed. Guaranteed. I thought it was six million ninety. Six years extension. Extension. On and top he, of the five year. He has two left. Right. Oh, so he was already in contract. Right. 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 You know what? That, I got to give it to a brother right. that's already in a contract right. and he holds out mm-hmm. and said, I want more years and more money. Right. And I ain't even took care of the first part yet. As an aside, so let me say that. You know, since I'm in contract now, I would like to renegotiate. <laughs> you can be franchise, wave, practice squad, Home Depot, whatever you want to do, brother. You, you, you're trying to pay me to to Sir, I right. guarantee you. I call it THU and I'm like, hey, I need to tumble in. Like, no. A Jerry Jones yeah. deal, right. you will not get it. Well, I'm talking about a Bartholomew deal. I'm just trying to. That's, and that, and, and right. this stage, because I ain't Jerry. Right, 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 right. I ain't got the Jerry. I'm, I'm right. close, but I ain't Jerry yet. Yeah, yeah. So, I, I got to give it to a dude who's able to do that, man. 50 million. Guaranteed money. But you know what? They front loaded it, though. That was kind of smart. What happened? They front loaded They put it on the front. So, therefore, last two years he got left. Then the first two years of the new deal, mm-hmm. he gets all that 50 million in. Right. So, guess what? Everything after that, you have to earn that play. I thought they weren't guaranteed contracts in anyway. Football. There's guaranteed money. They're the only sports franchise that actually use the terms guaranteed money. Right. Because everything you get in the NBA is guaranteed. Right. Everything you get in MLB right. yeah. and hockey, all of it, everywhere. The only people that's not practicing guaranteed money is the NFL. Right. But the collective bargaining agreement is coming up. 
Tyler Reed goes ahead. Yeah, 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 with CBA, right? Well, what? Tell me about that. Didn't he? Wasn't he one looking for a, a deal first? Did he get his deal closed? I mean, you're being dead. Amari Cooper and Dak Prescott are still not extended yet. Right. right. And the, the real deal about that is a quarterback doesn't hold out. Why? What? You're the quarterback. Right. There's no – you don't have another running back. Zeke Elliott was getting talked about being replaced by Tony Pollard. Right. That's, uh, you don't have quarterbacks like that. Right. How many, you know how many quarterbacks come out of the draft and how many actually mean something? Dude, like maybe three out of all 30 of them that are drafted. Okay. Maybe one may be real good. Really? The rest of them is like, eh, no, Vince not that. Vince Young. Shout yeah. out to Ryan Leaf. Indeed, sir. And the list goes on. <laughs> <laughs> Matty Wire and all right, that. Right. The list goes right. on. Right. Well, I think I got Tony Romo. Where's that guy? Say, man. That's my boy. Shout out. Watch him out. Right. Watch him out. Tony Romo. Tones. Number nine. Tones wrong. Real number nine. Real number nine? Real number nine. Jordan did. So. Yes, sir. Yeah, Jordan did. That's why. Yeah. Right. Real number nine. Right. 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 So, mm-hmm. to start this birthday shenanigans. That's right. Now that we got everything already talked about on what's happening now, mm-hmm. it is now time to continue our weekly tradition. Let me bring on some of LA's faves. These are my favorite people. The, the, take two. These are my favorite people in the radio biz doing it. I like to give a special shout out to my girls, Candy J and Michael B. Welcome, welcome. What up? What up? What up? First of all, hello. My name is not Michael B. I don't know where you got the B. <laughs> I thought it was the B for like you be fly, you be doing this. She be what? right that part. You be I mean, what? you do be fly though. Be, what the heck? No, Michael of that B. It's Michael of Shanae with Michael of So For Real. Oh. How you doing? Speak on it. It's So For What? You know what? And first of all, let me just say. Welcome to the show. Right. Happy to have you. Say here. hello first. To hello. Our viewers. Um, hello, viewers. How are y'all doing? The microphone is right here. Hello, hello, you the radio. Hello, viewers. There you go. <laughs> New radio. radio veteran. <laughs> right. Right. Loosely. 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 And what y'all see right now is our guests actually going live. So apparently yeah. they need more attention. Which is why I'm so glad we got these women in the studio today. Because the, because the women else. got to have so much. They got to have oh, attention okay. for attention. Mm-hmm. They got to have the attention for the attention of the attention that they're already getting. I'm going to just say I've been feeling attacked since I walked in this building. Um, no need. And I don't appreciate it. No need. But what do you mean? You want some water? We like some water? No, I haven't been here in so long. But my baby, like you just ain't and seen and nothing, and nothing, nothing yet. yet. I love you, girl. I love you, girl. It's all that well, matters. Well, it's That's good to see you, Candy. Hi. How are you doing? Happy I'm birthday, wonderful. Beyonce. Oh. Today is Beyonce. Ooh, is it today? Oh, she's a fellow Virgo. Is it today? I already, I already shot B a text earlier. So oh, did you? Oh. What? She did did you call her? Say anything? She always does. She had texted me. Oh, okay. She had texted me. Yeah, we know that's work. false. <laughs> <laughs> that's false. That's false. That's false for sure. Right, right. I cannot. We can't have our phone. Is Beyonce pregnant? Did I hear that correctly? Is she a pregnant again? Is Beyonce pregnant again? I ain't gonna, t- I ain't gonna take my boy business like that. You know, I ain't getting into that. I don't think so. I don't know. Jigga. Jigga. They don't need no more kids. Bowls. They ain't no more kids. They don't have Romy no and. Why not? I don't even know Major. the twins' name. Mm-hmm. And then okay. blue. Mm-hmm. That's least, all I got. These ain't got northwest, south, and all that. East, west. Yeah. That's south, coming down next. Down south, right? <laughs> coming down hard. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Orange. Right. right. Chicken. Welcome y'all to the show. We're so glad to have y'all. Thank we you. understand that y'all two ladies have great shows yourself. We do. We do. And you've been What's on them, yes? Okay. Yes, yes. We'll start with we'll start with Michael. Michael. Michael, if you will. Before that happens, I'm sorry. Okay, okay, before. I was warned against calling you Michaela. I'm glad they warned you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so he's probably going to call you Michaela. Will you leave it at that? Well, I'm going to leave it at that. I'm glad they warned you. Okay. So, well, so for the rest of the show, I'm probably going to call you that. But don't worry about it. Keep going. We're good. Um, so, Harris, please, continue. Michael. Um, yes. I am Michael and Shanae with Michael and So For Real. And um, thank you, LA. You know, happy birthday to you. Okay. And thank you for having me. Um, yes, my show is every Sunday. 
um, from three to four on Power Play Radio so Network. Huh? What is it? What's the name of it? Michael is so for real. Oh, Michael is so for real. So sanctified for real. Mm-hmm. Oh, Sunday. So, Sunday, so for so, real with Michael. Us. So, yes, yes. Michael, uh. Shout out to the KMWI Media because this is where I started. Whoa, well, that is best. right. Oh, I here. totally forgot about that. You started right here. I did. This is how me. What was your show? What was it in your show? It was Michael so for real. Michael so for real. Sorry. Yeah. Still good. Still good. So for real. Okay. That's a R and B group, right? Am I wrong? It is. It is. Candy Ray. Candy Ray. Yeah, that was it. Thing I wait, wait, are y'all old enough to know Candy Ray? I am. Yeah, okay. Every little thing I do, you're on my mind. You're on my mind. Hey, do the dance move. I think it was, wasn't it a little? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and also, we sh- Can you read those eyes back in? <laughs> I also would like to give a shout out to Candy <laughs> J for all of you. Hey, sing it now. Sing it. Sing, okay. sing it we now. Sing it. Sing it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Candy, welcome back to KMWI. Back to KMWI. Maybe? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Thanks. Thanks, guys. Good to see you again. Yeah. Oh. The last time we saw you on your show. It was two weeks yeah. ago. Right. It was two weeks ago. Oh, okay. <laughs> that one, yeah. I don't remember, it was but it was, a, it was a live show. I love it. Was it. Show, it was right. awesome. It was. I enjoyed it. Yeah, y'all were just so... Still waiting for right. Speaking Set, of waiting on pay. Wait, mm-hmm. does Nate get paid? Oh. Nate does not get paid. Yeah. Oh, that so was, when you pay me, I'll pay, pay you for the show. Right, right. right. That right. way. Right. That part, right, that part, right, that part. When you pay it. Right. So, I'm going to get into... Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That part. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 That part. Yeah. That part. Yeah. That part. Oh. Since this, y'all what, what always address right. Listen. us oh, men yeah. with certain <laughs> things. <laughs> Let me address something. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and keep it general, real quick. I just want to know what are some things because you know we're not a relationship show. We are not, even though we talk about relationships every week. Every week, but we are not a relationship relationship show. show. We are against it. We're the anti. Christ? Pro oh. relationship show. Anti pro, <laughs> right. right? Right. I had to think. Yes. Anti yes. pro relationship show. Well, yes, we are the antithesis of relationship show. They mm. love it and not the same. Yeah, we have them, but we right. just don't. We don't, we're, we're we're not, not showcase them. Nah, we don't. No advertise for that. Right. Yeah. So. Relationships over it. Hmm. I want to know, ladies. Ladies. Gentlemen. That includes Nathan. Um, <laughs> what are the things I cannot. that bug you Does he about the opposite sex? I mean, if you could pick one major yeah. thing, excuse me, there's an actual show here. Oh. So, yeah, but one major be. thing that bugs you about the opposite sex. What is it? Liars! Ooh. I felt that in my spirit. Yeah. I felt that in my the shadow. Video. I felt I that. <laughs> The sound system that we tried so frivolously to correct. <laughs> What's the word? <laughs> Jesus. Um, no, I've been, I've been, mm. uh, right, right. I've been, uh, mm. okay, so we've heard from you, uh, Michael. Okay, um, one thing that bugs me about the opposite sex, I would say just the, the way y'all think. Y'all, oh, well, y'all. Sorry, well, the opposite please, sex. Please identify. The opposite sex, the way the opposite sex thinks, the, the, even when it comes to being on time, it's just y'all. I would like you to y'all, elaborate a little more on that. Okay. For example, so we can do this. Oh, okay. For example, okay. <laughs> instead, instead of you, or instead of a man, um, I don't like the way you're looking. Instead of well, ignore him, ignore him. Yeah, like it's easier to just speak to me because he's speaking to the audience. You know what? I'm Please gonna go talk right to you. Yeah. You know I'm gonna take these off. Right cool ahead. Right. Oh, right. oh, 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 oh my god! Oh my god! Hey! hey. hey. Woo. Right? Yeah. yeah. You're be, be, be careful. He turns too. Oh, damn. be careful. Not turn. I switch. I switch. Why ain't my question been answered yet? Michael. Okay. He laughed. He laughed. Okay. For example. If, from my experience, men say stuff like, 
well, I didn't tell you because you was going to get mad anyway. How do you yes. know that? You know, the fact that you... Did you get mad? That part. Did you get mad? Because I found, had to find out. But did, did it anger you when you found out? But I wouldn't have been angered had you just told me. Had you told the truth oh. to begin with. That's the whole point. We wouldn't have gotten mind. upset. That's, that's what I'm saying. Huh? But, but, but you're saying, like, if, if, if he had said it originally, you wouldn't have gotten mad. Is that is that your premise to say that if you just been honest with you, you wouldn't have been that mad? part? I, I can't even say that, but I'm saying I would have exactly. appreciated False. the. You right. can't listen. You have to also understand. You cannot control how I react. It, react. But, to I, what you say. That, but I can control how the information I give you is going to be perceived because I know that you could possibly act like that over that information. Therefore, by omission, I'm out. Well, maybe just don't. So do, lying, don't do lying by omission is still lying, lying though. But I, but I, I, I would say, I would say this is that if he lying. has a preconceived notion of how you would react, it's because you may have reacted that way previous to that. So if he's not going to come out of nowhere and say, okay, well, I think you're going to act a certain way unless you've acted. No, no. no because no. a lot of people come history. into relationships with uh -huh. preconceived notions exactly. because she acted like that way. She acted like that way. Exactly. You're going to act that way. And right. that's not the case. Well, is that not the one of the tenets of an open and honest communicative relationship that you're saying that I would talk to you about things that happen in our lives and be safe? To not get ridiculed for being open about it. Right. Mm -hmm. It should be that it way, be. but not it's everybody not. comes in I that got way. An idea. And I'm speaking for both sides. <laughs> I, don't I got an idea. I don't know this was just, the idea part of the show. It just Please, Michael, give how, us your idea. How about just don't do anything that you have to lie about? Girl. <laughs> right. So, Girl. do you live in the world where, every, where everything is on the up and up? You are, your moral compass always points north. You have you have no misgivings about anything you've ever done. You've been honest one hundred percent about everything you've ever done to anybody you've ever in done life. With no. in life. Right. So, how can you make that statement? Okay. Don't do things. We can all say don't do things right. that would cause you to lie about it. But we want to preserve our relationship. We want to preserve our situation. Maybe we made a mistake. And if As burying knows. it, burying that lie, burying that truth, burying that ugliness will cause me to live another day with you. And I mean, I can't agree with you on that part, oh, but I will say this, though. Uh, and I've said it several times to several people. Like, if you tell me the truth and I and it's still going to hurt, it might be like that prick at the doctor's office. You know, it hurts like mother freaking hell. But it goes away real quick, right? 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 I but I buy a baby on you, and I told you a friend, it goes away real quick. But if you found out, I'm sorry. What? Later, what? What did you say? He said you I'm had a baby on me. So, so if, you if the a man, baby, if the man had a baby outside of him, yeah. Right. And then he told her versus her finding out nine months later. The first me telling her up front would be a prick and well, yeah. it go away. But well, no, but I think what she's gonna no. say to that is probably you should have told her nine you months had before sex with you. Girl. Like that well, would be And then that would have been a prick, and then right. if she got pregnant, it's fine. Yeah, because you're sure they knew. The no. prick healed. Sure they knew. You but what I'm saying is, if you're honest. And it's available, y'all better get out. <laughs> I might not. <know>. Um, so. <laughs> Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. So listen, Max, listen, listen to this though. So if you tell me that oh I'm having a baby with this other woman, right? Back. You give me a chance to actually process and go through. I'm not speaking for all women. I'm not speaking for all women. Mm -hmm. I'm speaking for me and and they women like me. That that will go. Okay, wait a minute. So you've been cheating on me and you got pregnant. Okay, how all this happened? What, what's the facts behind all of this? You're going to give me a chance. You have to give me a chance to process. And you have to give me a chance to process. Because I, know, I have dealt with many friends, three of them actually, that have been in this very circumstance. And two of them stayed and one of them did not. The two that stayed, the husband told them up front, Okay, I just found out old girl's pregnant. This is what's happening. Okay, can we work it out or not? And they figured out how to work it out. 
The other one, he lied. He he waited until it was nine months. The baby was coming out at the Shameful. hospital. Shameful. And then he told her. And everything. Right. Everything. He was a junior. Maybe so a it's it's different. It's different strokes for different folks. There's not a right formula for any man or any woman, but you have to know what's right for your relationship. So and and telling those white lies is not always going to work. Go ahead. Well, no, I was going to ask for uh, Michael to speak on if because I mean, uh, Candy said that she didn't agree with you. Mm-hmm. Do you agree with anything that she has said post uh, post your, your comment, mm-hmm. like in regards to being honest up front and saying what you feel? Okay, first of all, he's still talking, so I'm waiting for him to finish his complete sentence. Oh, thank God, because nobody else does that on this. <laughs> Nobody don't else ever. does that. Don't Nobody else don't does that. Don't feed it to him. He's going to antagonize you the whole time. You go back to episode <laughs> two. Because there is no episode one. Real south side come up out of me. You right, know. right. right. <laughs> oh, no, I was just saying if you had anything to add to that or if you, if you uh, piggybacked on she what she was saying. Mm-hmm. I totally agree. I totally agree with okay. everything that she said. Right. That is that is absolutely true. Um, me personally, you could have been up front. I'm glad you. I'm glad, mm-hmm. but y'all go ahead. See, you know. So it's one and done. Lost it anyway. One and done. But okay, you. But you, you gonna lose her thing. on one side. You are gonna lose on the other side. Okay, okay, I'm glad you brought some up because I had that's your question. Go ahead, that's your question. Why? Why do women want the details? Why? Why do you want to know where I met her? How did she look? How did she talk? What did y'all do after you met? How? What was the first kiss? What did you first know you had the sexual desire for? Why do you want to know all of that? If it's already painful Mm -hmm. that it has happened, that you can use your own imagination about all of this, why would you want to smear your in your face with details? Because we want to make an educated decision on what we're about to do. That what is you knowing that all oh, she had on the purple dress and you know not that part. That, well, that is what y'all, y'all yeah you're asking for details again. I'm speaking for Candy and some women, not all. Thanks. Okay, okay let me speak for Michael and myself. Most of the time when you're cheating, we kind of be having a little. We know sometimes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So when we want the details, so that we can go back and put back pieces, like oh okay. That's what he. That's why you was acting oh, like okay. that. Why you said so that. Oh, yeah, you mm-hmm. said oh, so that. Now it makes all sense. I finally put all the pieces so, together. So now that I have is, all of that, and uh-huh. I put this educated guest together, and I'm like, hmm, okay. So now I feel like a fool. So bye. If that that is that is the optimal word. Women want to know how much of a fool they've been played mm. for. Yeah. Two things wrong with that. Because we can deal. One with, is you know, look, look all women have hindsight at the end of the day. I knew it. I knew you didn't know. If you no. knew it, you'd have already conquered it, no. addressed it. No, no, no. not if true. You knew it, not you true. Would have no. known it. Not you would have true. Kept getting played. Oh. No. You would have kept getting done mm-hmm. mm-hmm. astray. You would have mm-hmm. kept getting all that. Mm-hmm. Secondly, mm-hmm. the second thing is that women always think. That they have the right formula to tell a man how he went about cheating. They put the pieces that you ain't you don't know what the puzzle is. You don't know what made me want to cheat. You don't know. You didn't you got to ask me for all of that. But see what y'all do is y'all are good at manipulating the information you get. I would actually and, only a man yeah, will they, make they, you they, feel they, bad they, for him cheating. No, I ain't saying about feeling bad. I said bad. I said that you can't tell me. Why I did something. Women got that bad to tell a man why he did this or why he did wrong or whatever. Ask him. And then you know what? Here's another novel idea, ladies. But you just said you're going to Here's cry. another. Uh, like you interrupted like now. Like, hush, I'm talking. You First asked me to give you some information. <laughs> I'm trying to give you some information. And you too busy doing this. That's but another he, problem. He don't want to respond to what he has to respond. say. Yeah, you can respond. He don't want to have to respond. I'm not done talking. I'm not done talking. I don't need so to respond. shut up. Like Who the hell are you yelling at, L.A.? Okay. Everybody that's in this room on my show. First. And he's wrong. Always. Right. Yeah, I know. 
First of all, let me tell you something. Women play Inspector Gadget all the time. And we will converse. Converse. <laughs> and we will figure out some things. And sometimes we know what has all transpired before we ever come to you and ask you what is happening at this point. Most of the time we already know. We just want your confirmation. That we know what we know. Mm -hmm. right. I, I would have to disagree with that. <laughs> Go ahead, baby. And I don't always agree with the mm -hmm. way. Um, Somehow when we bring guests in, they don't bring us together. <laughs> um, what, 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 normally, what, what, I, what I've experienced and what I've seen is that the women get a small nugget. Now, now there might be an, an intuition or an, an idea that, you know, maybe something was going on, but they're not for sure. Because in any other facet of your life, when you feel like something's wrong or you're being made a fool of, you voice it. You say, hey, what's going on with this? What's the problem with that? You, yeah. you don't want to be made a fool of. But you, you're saying that in a situation where you already knew all these different things were happening, but you didn't say anything about it. Why, why wouldn't Did you Did we say? not? Well, in, in that scenario, I mean, because you bring it up, you say, hey, where were you last night? You know, I, I felt like you were out with... Mm -hmm. somebody doing something or whatever the intuition is mm -hmm. uh, how, how does that manifest itself or are you saying like you come to the come to the person and say I'm, I'm done with this because I can't trust you some of us like to get all of our facts before we confront on that part right, so, so for instance when um, my ex-husband cheated um, I was looking at phone records mm -hmm. <laughs> I had called the phone number to see who was going to answer right. the phone right, and right. and I had uh, got the girl's social security phone, uh, number oh, her address oh. all of these things but, but to, to, to that is you took it to the end of the earth you took it, you took it that far uh, right that's your limitations you don't want... right that's your limitations you right of right. right. okay. complete statue. <laughs> But once you don't trust him, isn't the relationship tainted already? Yes yeah, and no. Easy, but we are forgive we are forgiving creatures as well. You yeah, gotta that, remember that part. That's, that's your fault. What what that, part that, is that, my, that, that our is fault. your fault? If I if you're coming to me saying that if I cheated, let's say mm -hmm. your relationship and I cheated, and uh, you thought that I did, or you had an mm -hmm. inkling that I, I had some sort of infidelity. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm asking if you forgive me, that's your choice. Right. I, I, I didn't come to you forgiveness, but you gave me forgiveness. So if it doesn't work out in the end, if we continued on, like I said, you didn't trust me. Mm -hmm. So you thought that I would cheat. You didn't trust me. So that part is your admission that, okay, I don't trust you and I don't think that you were, you were faithful to me, but I'm going to continue this relationship. Okay, but are we trying to work it out or no? Because at that point... If trust is lost, how can you work things out? But trust can be regained. Uh huh. Whoa. I mean, we can we, we I mean we can teeter totter on this all day long. Oh, we're we're, we're gonna have an A B. You okay? Be a. No, trust cannot be. <laughs> I, I would say because there's always that thought in the back of your mind: Is this happening again? So I'm you're sure one and done. Not, I am with my. So I'm you're gonna, with my. I'm one and done. Are okay. we sure that we're Once, not? I'm not because I'm not gonna put that. I'm not gonna put. Death, my, I'm sorry. Death. I'm not gonna put myself in that situation to be sitting around thinking that I'm being made a fool of. Again, mm -hmm. once you've already burned me, but how do we get here? That's how do we said, get here? That's easier said than done, and okay. it's easy to say, "Yeah, I'm gonna leave." But when you love somebody, and you've probably been that with that part. person for a long time, mm -hmm. you're not gonna just easily just leave like that. You're not gonna want to. You know, you're gonna try. Hold on, we, please. please. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, Mr. Really? Anderson. Since I'm not getting paid, go ahead and talk. Exactly. Hush up. Uh -huh. Now, right. I understand both sides. I get. Why Nathan says that Nathan's a man. Oh, thank God. Ish. 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 Now, <laughs> I'm mad. as a man is, right, right. men have pride. Mm -hmm. Some <laughs> Neanderthals like Nathan are not able to. It's pronounced Neanderthal. You know, are not able to take pride <laughs> and fully, you know, weigh the checks and balances of how it needs to go with their decision making. So it's kind of like pride's first. Mm -hmm. So. Nathan being made a fool of, which I'm very confused because every Wednesday at 8 p.m., it's like clockwork. Right. But for some reason with the lady, you know, and you know, I mean, 
only dates. Yeah. But anyway, uh, with the lady, Women. he feels that he only dates. You know, no, 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 no. <laughs> Finish that fucking sentence. He only dates. Oh my god! Women. Sorry, Costco. I guess we won't right. be getting their advertising. Weren't you doing this motion a minute ago? <laughs> Don't give me that Costco <laughs> shit now. No, fuck that. Uh, so, we wide so, open now, baby. So men can't assess the pride correctly. You know, pride hey. overshadows everything else. <laughs> but you know. Understanding guys like myself, they get, 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 they get that there's flaws in people, they get that there's things, you know, uh, pros and cons of everything. I am not going to just simply lean on the fact that, oh, you fooled me once, you know, and that's it, you know, no more. No, I mean, you know, I, there's obviously some trust somewhere. Now, in a specific area, I feel like there may be a level of trust that gets broken that needs to be rebuilt. But overall, if you don't trust a person to take care of this, it's not like, okay, well, they weren't watching my back. They weren't helping with the kids. They weren't helping provide. You know, if you cheat on somebody, that's a facet of it. But to just say completely that they're nothing to you no more, I don't think that's the case, which I believe Michael is trying to kind of evoke as well that Let's you go. love somebody. Go ahead, so I want Michael to jump in on that, of course, because she's been trying right. at the waiting day. for you to finish. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Michael is jumping in over there with your conversation. Um, and Ben. Okay, like you said, well, as far as, the, first I want to say, as far as the pride, like he said, that's your fault. You know, right. I don't have any pride. Well, mean? no, you said the men that have pride. Yeah, and I was talking about him. If okay, you were well, then the that's show. your fault, then. Right. I'm just saying. Don't, 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 don't. Yeah, no, 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 no. That's all cotton candy and nonsense. Don't worry about it. Keep going. So we can go. Keep going, Greg. Yeah, um, but mm-hmm. in regards to what you were saying, um, yeah, I think that the whole pride is, that's not a good excuse. What? I mean, the, 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 it's not. I, I said no, she's not done. Please, Michael. It sounded like she was I, tapering off. Was that it? Girl, anyway, all I was going to say is that the, the, the pride thing is, is not what I was going to say, is not what I was uh, 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 referring to. I was only referring to you're not going to fool me again. I, I don't want to put myself in a situation. I'm a seasoned veteran when it comes to okay, well, okay. So let me ask this question. Seasoned veteran. seasoned veteran. Now, as far as the well, as oh, far as the more. As far as the baby, now that's what I'm saying. As okay, far, okay. We'll but the cheating, I mean, I'm older now, so mm-hmm. I. I would try to understand, you know what I'm saying? Because I have you have to look at yourself sometimes. So, you know. But how do we get here? Like, nobody has answered that question. Okay, okay. How do we get here? Define that. You're right. So that's, how do we get to the what, point where you're cheating or I'm cheating? How do we get have, here? Yeah. Because that, to me, that's what really matters, whether or not I'm going to actually stay or I'm leaving. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to put some information out there. Of course But as a base okay. man, mm-hmm. you know, the lizard brain, we mm-hmm. want to conquer. We want to. We, we see something we're attracted to, and we try, the, well, the lower chromosome <coughs> brain, the lower brain, the lizard brain, we all have it. It's evolutionary. Anyway, we'll, we'll talk about that later. Um, so I'm just saying that the, the base, <laughs> right, the base man is about conquering, is about uh, planting his flag. You mm-hmm. see something, you tr- see somebody you're attracted to, and you want to so conquer. It. So it's hard to, it's hard to overcome that sometimes. So it may be something that. You might have been busy one day. You might have been out of town one day, and the opportunity presented itself. I'm not going to use like alcohol or anything like that to say it's a, it's a situation, I mean, but it's... there isn't always a reason to say, "Oh, well, because you didn't cook me breakfast, or because you didn't hug me enough, or because it, it, it could very well just be because okay. I wanted someone." Different. Okay, let me turn this around. Okay. What would what would y'all do? What what would be you, like you said, one and done, Go ahead. but you? I that think he was he's forgiving. No, I, I'll allow it. I just sometimes it's good to be the dom. And Sir, sometimes it's good to be I <laughs> told you I do not want to know what you have going. So I don't think honest. he would be you a daddy, daddy dom. You know what I hear no more that, Michael, no, Michael, Are you a daddy dom? Michael, please go forward if, if you, you can stop that. We, 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 so we, we will continue. Would be, you would be after forgiving. Oh, okay. you, would, you wouldn't just leave. It's not yes, I I feel like love. Makes us all do stupid, right things, wrong things, stupid, smart things, dumb things. It does, mm-hmm. but I do feel that you know, as a sainted man that I am, what I definitely feel 
better. Anything we've read out of that book. Did he say sanctified? Forgiveness sanctified. is all throughout that book. Because if I'm scared put holy water on him. The book you mean the Bible. Oh, yes. yes. If God gave his only God's son. Mm-hmm. And sacrifice him for our sin. Hallelujah. Who are we to go on in this earth not willing to forgive? So no, I'm a man of forgiveness. Yeah, will you have to sell me into round two of this? Yeah, you will. So you will you to have to beg? Uh, and again, I hate the big word. It's not begging. It's not. I don't think it's begging. I point, think it's so. proving. I think it's persuading. You got to sell yourself too. You had to sell yourself in the beginning, so you got to sell. Now that you've seen the the downfall, you, you got to sell selling yourself. What, yeah, you are. You always selling. Yourself. No, I said you should never stop. Oh, selling that, yourself. yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. business person, right, mm-hmm. right on. Mm-hmm. So, uh, I mean, I, I definitely, I definitely forgiven, and I believe that that is very important. Right. I don't think that you can really have a functioning relationship without it. I also think that that may even lead to a lot of the issues in relationship, such as cheating. But but you we got, know, to, we got to do you, well one thing real quick. Oh, you always got to. Absolutely, I'm always extra. You don't. You, so you're believing in hard truth. You're believing. Do you not believe that there are absolutes that you can't get over? Cheating being one of them. I don't think cheating is one of them. So okay, I think that cheating is not murder. Answer. I mean, in a relationship. <laughs> no, I'm just, if you no, murder no, my child, you murder my child, you're going to jail. Okay, so no, I don't you have to die. make that decision. Let's, let's There's no going to jail. There's no going to jail. He's, if he murders my child, he's going to jail. No, no. there's no going to jail. I'm going to murder you too. Well, no, so I, what I'm saying is that... that <laughs> if somebody hits, hey, if somebody Chris Brown's your daughter, they're going to be dead? Aren't, isn't that what you said? Let me talk to you. Right. If, if somebody says an, 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 a, a, a curt, un, unkind <laughs> word to him <laughs> too many times, <laughs> I'm going to know their address where they live. <laughs> Their shoe size, suit size to fit them for the bad boys. Bad boys. I'm just saying, it's but that's that, that that's an extreme. But what I'm saying is an absolute. Like I think cheating is an absolute. I, I think know. you I expressed know. yourself, and, and and we all have preferences. It's a it's a it's a level. I think it's a level of cheating. So what is the level that stops you from giving getting taking that person back? What is the level? I believe that if I because here's the thing: when cheating happens, nobody is can. People believe that everybody somehow is in this happy relationship. There's nothing wrong. I didn't see it coming. No. I haven't talked to now one person at this table or anywhere that didn't feel like something bad is on the horizon. Winter is coming or something like that. You know. You know if something bad's about to go down in your relationship. So nobody sitting up there living a fairy tale life and then all of a sudden, bam, they get slapped in the face and cheated. I don't think that's the case, especially if you are involved in that relationship the way you should be. Effective communication, time spent, and constantly courting that person. If you're doing those three, you're going to find out some cheating is around the car. Right. If you ain't, then you won't. Wait a minute. I agree with L.A. What? I agree. Shut up. Okay, okay Bessie. Hey, man. T- hey, okay. Man, it's a birthday. I'm trying to give you these nutty gems real quick. So. Uh, Nathan, before we get to it. I know you got some. Just got one more last thing. And let's see if we can keep this kind of show. Real quick. Uh, well, we don't have to. You know, I'm good for next week. No, no, no. I'm good for next week. Hold it. So. I want to know. It's twofold. I want to know why women, and I'm going to ask Nathan this first so we can make them wait on it. And I'll be brief. Wait on it. Be brief the way Nathan is brief. Yeah. Which is happy. So, um, why do women want to claim to be old school but do so many new school things? They want to. Because it's. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'll set it up. They, They want to be able to. Take control of relationships and call the shots, but want a man to always have a back behind their decisions, no matter if they right or wrong. How they want to be the ultimate breadwoman and get the bag and get the queens, but then want the man to pay for everything as if he just got money like that. How 
they will belittle that man if he ain't got stacks on stacks on racks on racks. But okay, you want to always make sure that he's the provider. Why is it that women think that their vagina is more valuable than a man's penis? Negative. Can you answer these? Can you riddle me all of this, please? Well, uh, you Give spoke on everybody. multiple different topics. Um, <laughs> the old school, new school thing is... Make, is, is, make is, a way on it. No, no, I'll be brief. I'll be brief. The, mo the, the, the old school, new school thing, I think, has to do with uh, the situations that they're in okay, and who, they're, who their audience is. Mm -hmm. um, as far as the spinning the coin, getting the bag, but they want the man to spin the coin, and I'll, I'll sound very cliche when I say this. Come on, I, I, hate, I hate that I say this. Talk but about. If the woman is out getting the bag and the man is getting the bag, the coin is community property. So it doesn't really matter if they get the bag or if you get the bag. If you're in a relationship that's committed, mm -hmm. then everybody's coin is spent when you go out. So it's a community account. It's not your bag or my bag. It's our bag. That's what I'll say to that. As far as the penis and the vagina thing, I think it has, I think it has a lot to do with women's sense of what they're giving us. They're they're blessing us with their presence. Um, it, it, you know, they want Lavity. us. To, they want us to feel like so um, we are lucky to attain them. <laughs> right. if, you, if you think about it, in a, in, a, in, a, in, a, in a society where we're taught that men approach women, we're trying to get them. Yeah. We're trying to attain them. We're trying to please them. We're doing trying, our role. Right, we're doing our role as right. a man to do that. And it's a part of it. And once we are able to get that. They say, "Well, here you go. You're welcome. You you have You're welcome. you have gotten to the level where you can have sex with me. Wow! So you are blessed, and, and we can welcome. continue the relationship. And <laughs> if you have sex with me, right, it better be good. The audacity! Oh my! Thank Nathan. That's me being brief. Sir, I appreciate the question. We can now move forward uh, now to what you all, have. First of all, uh, uh, Michael is pursing her lips, so she has something to say. No, sir, we don't even need that. We don't even need that. It's our show. Right. We ain't got to hear no more. All right, right. 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 No. I'll tell you what, I'm going to let Nathan go. I'm, I'm going to give a gift again. Right. Nathan, yeah. you, tell, you tell us what we need to hear from them. I need to hear from Michael. You want to hear from me? Right. I want to hear from Michael just because she is making a lot of gestures and motions and she has something to say. Well, well you know, she's not really strong suited in the microphone talking right. part, so of course. She's been pretty good. Finish it up. You're wrong. Speaking, 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 speaking of anything that LA, LA said, I, I just said my opinion, uh, but anything that LA said in regards to relationships and how we are perceived as men and women so and our Michael role in relationships. Uh, um, I, I don't have a lot to say about that. I just okay. was, yeah. You just because I, I do have a lot, but we only got six minutes. In. Right. We, what? Man, this is a birthday show. We got, oh, we got, we got plenty of time. They have plenty of time. Yeah, we, we can go over. We can go over. So, if you have something to say. So that, if, if you have something to say, if not, because I know kick us <laughs> you got Because candy. Uh, and we sort of got time for that, even with overtime. Right? So <laughs> what we're going to do, if, if that's the case, what we're going to do, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to go into the question portion. Mm -hmm. Question. I do agree with what you said about it being the community right. money. I do agree about that. Um, yeah, bags are bags. 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 As far as like, bags. Yeah, bags yeah. Bags. I do agree about right. that. As far as the woman feeling like the vagina is just so valuable, I mean, it is. Oh, girl. We are valuable. Yeah. We are. Are you saying that to say that men aren't? Or are you saying just no, to say that? No, I'm not saying that. Okay. Exactly. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Because I want to hear her say that. that. I want to hear her say but that. But she didn't say it. No, no, she, she didn't say it. She did not. But you, you have, have to bring it up to her attention. No, no, the for absence to give of problem. one. That's the problem with no. me. No. You got to bring up attention. No, they're not giving us the responsibility. I was leading her down that path. But I want her to say, if she's saying the words that vagina is valuable, then equal time Wait, is the down. man Dude. or the penis valuable as well. They're both valuable They're both. to one another. I'm There's, just leading her down. Can't have one without can't the other. Can't have one without the other. Like leader. Right, right. The leader. Yeah, the leader. Yeah, thank you. Of the, of the head of the, mm -hmm. the house. Of, yeah. I read that book one time. Yeah. Jesus. Not uh -huh. The Jesus book. Not okay. Bob. <laughs> so, uh, mm -hmm. speaking on that, Candy, you have anything to bring up or talk about Ooh, can we in regards to? No? Two minutes? No? To what? What mm -hmm. you don't have you don't have you don't have a abridged version of no. No? okay so no. with that yes no. I, have <laughs> I have questions what kind of because questions? because I have I have an interest in Man, the minds of Man, people 
and what their thoughts are skewed towards. So I have some riddles and some questions. Well, just, just questions that are riddle-ish. Let's do it! Kind of naughty. Oh. Starting out. Right up the alley. Right up which alley? Yeah! She has several. There are always avenues. Baby, you and can I have will say, all three. Oh, I will okay, say sorry. this, and if you watch the show, you know what this means, but hey, we go to bed. <laughs> what is a four-letter word that ends in K Ooh. and means the same as intercourse? Jeez. Come on, Candy. You already have to be okay. I mean, what? Y'all are so disgusting. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> what? What did you say? Boo? It's, what? It's talk. The word intercourse means a exchange between two people or a group of people. I know, Christina. When you say the word sexual intercourse, it's because it's the misgivings or the or the operation between two people sexually. But and that's why they I like the sexual intercourse. intercourse, not just intercourse. But you see, when I say the last the letter, last letter is K, everybody oh, goes to. That's out. Uh, anyway, all the women. Right. All the women. I have another. Just this is a food related question. I'll help you out. It's a food related. Question. Yeah. So that way you can get your mind out of that. Sex and food. Okay. What is hairy on the outside, <laughs> the but soft and wet on the inside? Let's see. Oh. And whose <laughs> words start with the letter C? And end with the letter T. Oh. It's hairy on the outside. Hairy on the outside. But you would like our singing. I do it. 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 Especially when you have the wrong answer. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> It is hairy on the outside, but soft and wet on the inside. Ooh, and, whose, the and whose word starts with the C? Coconut? And hey, <laughs> There you go. There you go. Oh, we have a studio audience. <laughs> Next question. I go in hard, mm-hmm. but come out soft. Hey. I never mind. Facts. Penis. Right, right, right. Can I finish? Can I finish? Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Uh, we, we've been doing this. Next. 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 Good job. Yeah, good job. Okay. Excuse me. Good job. Good job. Chill Scott. Chill Scott. Okay. I go in hard but come out soft. And I never mind if you want to blow me. Mm. A blow pop? <laughs> blow, blow, blow. Safe from blow. I go in hard but come out soft. And I never mind if you want to blow. What am I? Mm. Chewing gum. Oh! <laughs> All I was thinking about was penis and a blow pop. I mean, I'm just saying. You can lick both. The penis. Because I like to blow. You know what? This goes to show how the penis seems to be more valuable than the vagina. Because ain't no man up here that did all the licking, licking, all of that. But right, right. Candy, the first thing she up here, I'm gonna get you. Speaking of Jill Ooh. Scott, when you get a chance, go listen to Rolling Hills. Oh yes. Yeah. Oh, excuse me, Jill That's Scott. Ain't what? Put, now we're checking. No, I'm right. Nathan, continue. But I, I'm a fan of Jill Scott. I'm a fan of Jill Scott too, but I ain't got to check. Keep on. What is at least six inches long? Hopefully, a dick goes in your mouth. A dick. And is more fun if it vibrates. A dick. <laughs> Can you at least try? Can you at least try? A toothbrush. A toothbrush. Good job, everybody. That's after the candy. day. Everybody That's after the day. Candy. Everybody. You gotta make sure you floss. You gotta make sure. Once again, baby, once again, proof why the penis is more powerful than the vagina. What goes up? <laughs> let's out a load. And then goes a back penis. down. A penis. A penis. Would you? Is this penis? A fork <laughs> lift. <laughs> Close. Crane. Crane. Close. Um. What goes up, lifts out a load, and then goes back down? A penis. The garbage <laughs> truck. So we have lost candy. So yeah. Candy's off. So, so we have now three people on the show. Is it a garbage <laughs> truck? No. I don't know. An uh. elevator. Mm. Oh, okay. Mm. Uh, <laughs> when I go in, I can cause some pain. I feel your holes when you ask me to. I also ask that you spit and not swallow. What am I? A mouth. 
So, everybody go to <laughs> No I'm Right 100. <laughs> What is that? An esophagus? Oh. <laughs> I have one more. I have one more uh, because <laughs> this is my this is this is my favorite. And maybe I'm gonna get it. But it's so simple. What is long and hard? A penis. And has come in it. A penis. <laughs> long, hard, and has come in it. What is long and hard and has come in it? And it's not a penis. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, what else is it? This is my favorite question. What is long and hard and has come in? Hey, Nathan. <laughs> what was the answer? Are we, are we done guessing? Yeah, I'm done guessing. A cucumber. Oh. What? A cucumber. 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 Okay. You nasty motherfuckers. Cool. Anyway, yeah. that was another yeah. edition yeah. of These Motherfuckers is Nasty. And, and, <laughs> <laughs> we thank you guys for joining Somebody us. Somebody said toothpaste. Uh, toothpaste, right. A banana. Like, like to thank we thank you for joining us. Everything has a foul. For coming through. Please give right. your information, if uh, any. Uh, <laughs> if you like to share your social media, your shows. <laughs> If you like more of that, <laughs> you reach that. Candyology C S that's C A N D Y O L O G Y C S at Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, all of those things. Candyology coaching services. Thank you. And you can catch me on uh, Facebook and Instagram, Michaela So for Real, M I C H A E L A S O F O R E A L. Always feel like fabulous so when I say that. Yeah, I know. Yes. Um, <laughs> but it's yes. all one word. So, yes. That's where you can find me. Hey. Sunday. Do you ever dream of candy coated raindrops? You're the same. I can't be right. You can DM us and know I'm right on Facebook. And Instagram. <laughs> Not Twitter because we don't have no characters. So, from the executive suite, and KWI Media, the executive suite, studio, this is Back. Dallas's favorite son, signing off. Sons. And I don't even want to throw it to y'all to sign off our time. Signing off and remember. No, I'm right. He's wrong. He's wrong. Who is it? But I'm always I'm right. right. No. <laughs> Y'all motherfuckers oh. nasty is what it is. Oh, and thank you, so, thank you to E. Nixon. Oh, no. I'm oh, sorry. You had a chance. 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 You had a